welcome back with the Spice Kitchen. Today we're going to do a lap guy. The lap guy is basically minced chicken mixed with some roasted rice, some mint leaves, some uh, kaffir lime, some shallots, some dried chilies, and of course some coriander. Um, the lap guy is a staple food of the Isan area or the northeastern part of Thailand. You usually have this with rice. You could also make it with duck, with beef, with pork. You just have to mince it up. The most important ingredient in this is the roasted rice. The roasted rice is basically you take raw rice, raw grain rice, toss it in the pan, get it really brown, and bring it out in the mortar, grind it down, put some kaffir lime leaf in it just to give it some smell. And then once you mix it into this salad or this minced meat, it will uh, give it another aroma. Sometimes even the Japanese use this in their teas, in their green teas. You can smell it sometimes when you have green tea. But today we're going to use it in the Isan food or the northeastern food of Thailand. For the lap guy, of course, we're going to start with the minced chicken. We're we'll turning up the heat. Basically, we're just going to mix this into the sauce pot. And we're going to keep adding all the ingredients as we go through. All right? While we wait for that to heat up, I might as well just cut my shallots. Just want to just like give it a good slice. Maybe half a shallot should be fine. There you go. Set it aside. Okay, the pan's hot now. I'm gonna pop our chicken in here. I'm gonna give it a good stir. As it starts to cook, you're gonna wanna add some water in it. Just a little bit of water. Get it going. You can use chicken stock as well. So once the water has gone to the chicken, I'm gonna give it a good stir so it gets fluffy. You don't want it to stick together too much. And once it comes off the pan, like you can see now, let it simmer through for a bit. Take your dried chilies, give that a good chop as well. You can use um, chili flakes, dried chili flakes that you know you put on pizza. But don't use paprika because that doesn't have enough burn on it. And the chicken's starting to simmer. Pop your onions in there and your dried chilies. Give it another stir. You want it to be a bit dry. You don't want to be too much liquid in there because once the roasted rice goes in then it starts to curdle up and you don't want it to be all sticky and not just a big meatball of chicken. Now you have some of the lime leaf, half a lime leaf, just about two is enough. Put a good slice on it, pop it in there. Okay, some lime juice. About two, tea, two or three tea, teaspoons. Fish sauce. There you go. We have it here ready. Two spoons. Give it a good stir again. And then some spring onions. Spring onions, you just want to chop it down. You can use the white part, the green part, it doesn't matter. in here and coriander just coarsely chop once or twice up in there now you want to turn off the heat spring it off the heat and now you put your roasted rice sprinkle the roasted rice generously over it give it a good flavor a good smell characteristic of the Isan food All right and then you have the chili oil and drizzle a little bit of that on top Gives a good, nice flavor and color. And once that is done, you can start plating. Just a few minutes. And lastly, we have some mint leaves. Good chop. Toss that in. Mix it together. It's your minced meat of lap guy.